Hey guys, it's Simeon. This is Pro Wrestling Unlimited. As it looks like Matt Jackson is currently working hurt with multiple knee injuries. Over the last few weeks, we've seen AEW doing a storyline where Matt Jackson has an injured ankle. After the Young Bucks became the number one contenders to the tag titles, FTR brutalized Matt's ankle with a steel chair. Then last night, when the Bucks took on Private Party, Matt sold the ankle through most of the match. Now, according to Brian Alvarez on the latest Wrestling Observer Radio, Alvarez stated that Matt Jackson is actually working with a knee injury. He stated that Matt has a partially torn MCL and a thinning of the ACL, which is considered a slight tear. The injury was suffered back on July 22nd when the Young Bucks took on the Butcher and the Blade in a false Count Anywhere match. When Matt hit the Butcher with an elbow drop off the top of the stage, the leg of the table jammed Matt's knee and he's been rehabbing it ever since. This is why they've been doing the ankle injury story, so Matt can sell the leg if it's hurting, and well, people just think it's all storyline. This is not the first time that Matt Jackson has done this. Back in, I want to say, late 2018, early 2019, when the Young Bucks were working for New Japan Pro Wrestling, Matt did a deal where he was selling his back in all the matches because, well, Matt had an actual back injury. So with that, if we do hear anything further on Matt Jackson's injury, how it could hamper his performance this coming Saturday at Full Gear, and what that all means, we'll have it for you right here on Pro Wrestling Unlimited. But that's going to do it for this episode. Remember to comment below, like, and share this video. Like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and subscribe right here on YouTube.